There is no doubt that in our recent history, Dr. Paratene Ngata has been instrumental in advancing health development in Ngāti Poro and has had a major influence on public health policy in New Zealand. Uncle Pat is an ardent advocate of science and research. This short documentary looks at how he became a doctor. And while he doesn't mention it, he actually holds three doctorates and a host of other qualifications. I was born here in, in, in Hawaii. Um, I was born here in Tolaga. Uh, on the uh, Thera, 6th of November 1946, and brought up at um, Imangatuna. I was born with my Yoko Chipuna, Peter Kumaru Rauko, Rutu, Tumoti Dili, as well as by my parents. Um, I bet uh, had a period of time, I bet Tararoa, uh, uh, I bet uh, Whakaangiangi, went to school there for a short period of time. But my main schooling was down here at, uh, uh, at Mangatuna. I was fortunate enough to uh, to get an Adam scholarship and was and my parents sent me off to Tipini, where I went to secondary school. I suppose I, did, I didn't choose medicine. Uh, my choice was either to do something like dentistry or in my final years I, I did science and, and at, at Tipini I think that's where I came under the influence of two very good science teachers. Rafiti um, Ihaka. Mr. Renolf at Tipini and took an active interest and they were excellent. They made science and maths uh, very exciting. It was Uncle Uppy who made the decision for me to do medicine. Uh, um, perhaps uh, he made a decision that uh, he said, Paratini, you're going to go down to Otago and you're going to do medicine. End of story. Starters was sent off down, went down to Otago. Um, the course is a six year course. Um, did what we call a medical intermediate, a primary year, first year to, of health sciences to get into to med school. And then did two, three years of, of what we call our preclinical years at Otago. And then fourth, fifth, and sixth years. Those are the years after that, what we call clinical years, where I went to Wellington and did my, my clinical training as a, as, a, as a trainee doctor. It's a wonderful career. It's an awesome career, dealing with helping others and helping people. But it's a career where you need, need to have a good grounding in, in two parts. You need to have a good grounding in science, in, tile, in, in your sciences. So there's not only what we call the science of medicine, and the science of healing, but there's also the art of medicine and the art of healing. Any young tamariki, mokopuna, who wants to become a doctor or a nurse, of course they can do it. They, yeah, nothing to stop anyone from becoming a doctor or a nurse, a scientist, a rocket scientist. Okay, it can be done. I have to face up to my own death and dying. Yeah, I've been diagnosed with, with uh, lung cancer in my left lung um, and it's spread around my lung. I'm taking a much more positive uh, approach now. I look at every day as a great day. Every moment is a great moment. So my focus instead of being on death and dying, I've dealt with all of that, is now on, on living. And, and enjoying living. You remember me when the west wind moves among the fields of barley. You can tell the sun in his jealous sky.
And you.